a moderate rain shower at 730, but through the valiant efforts of Jimmy Brown and the Bowman Gray Stadium track crew, we're still racing tonight. Street stocks first, David Creed on the pole. Lap three, third and fourth place, Jeremy Warren and Nate Gregg spin. Lap 18, Nate Gregg, under team orders, takes care of Jail Robinson Jr. for earlier upset the 28-98 team. David Creed takes the time limit win. Twin 25s for the mods, Tim Brown fastest with Burt Myers outside. Lap two, contact between John Holloman and Burt Myers. Burt somehow saves the one car. Burt Myers chases Tim Brown, but the orange 83 leads all the laps. It's Tim Brown's 94th career Bowman Gray win, but he is looking for championship number 11. Is it time to start thinking about championships? Man, I think about the championship 24-7, 365, you know what I mean? And uh, we're in a better shot, spot right now than we have been in the last few years, so absolutely it's time to think about a championship. I think it's our year. We're working hard for it, and I think we deserve it. 100 laps for the sportsman. Spencer Martin on the pole. Tommy Neal outside. Lap 5, defending sportsman champion Justin Taylor takes the lead from Martin. Taylor leads through lap 75 when Jacob Creed and Sterling Clemens spin. A lap 97 restart, Taylor still in the lead. Tommy Neal in third gets a flat tire. It causes a big crash with Amber Lynn. It'll lead to a green-white checkered overtime finish. Lap 103, Spencer Martin moves donkey strong Justin Taylor out of the lead. You mess with a donkey and you get um, your car messed up. So Martin will not win. Another overtime finish, lap 107. Kyle Southern now in the lead. He's racing Zach Orr hard for the win. Last turn, there is contact. Orr spins around, the track is blocked. Somehow, Zach Clifton shoots through the opening. Clifton takes an improbable win over Jacob Creed. The former sportsman champ can't believe his great luck. Man, I had the worst car I've ever had in my life here. They went into the three, they all washed up, I hit the gas and drove right underneath it, man. I mean, it was complete luck, but I, hey, I'd rather be lucky than good any day. At Bowman Gray Stadium, Jeff Amernick, WXII, 12 Sports.